What's going on YouTube and all you drunken misfits out here? I am here with just a quick little guide because I ran into this issue just today and couldn't figure it out. Uh, the other guides were missing a whole. St the other guides I found were missing a whole step uh, that was that uh, wasn't showing what you needed to do, and it was confusing me. So I figured it out on my own just by randomly clicking around. So the issue I ran into, I mean, is uh, the issue y'all are running into because y'all obviously searched for this. Steam was showing all my games were uninstalled even though they were not. So even when I went to launch my game, it would just show uninstalled, need to, you know, install the game. But I knew the game was installed. So what you want to do here, go ahead and open up your Steam. You see like right here. I've already done the fix. So right here it says play. Uh... So now what you want to do is come up here to your left here, go to uh, settings. Once you open up your settings, click right here, or you'll start here, go to downloads, go to Steam library. This was the step the other guides were missing, and uh, this is just a, it really is a quick, easy f uh, fix here. So you see uh, uh, C drive program file Steam. So net, all you want to do is literally add this. This is the step they were missing. They said just go to where your games are, which I went to Steam app or Steam apps, right? Nope. Right there. Common. That's what I needed. Every time I would click this, watch. Select. Select drive already has a Steam library folder. Steam will manage multiple games installed in a single folder for you. I was like, what the fuck? It's just not working. It's not working. This is the fix you need. Add library. Literally come to this drop down, click D, and once you do that, then come down here to Steam Library, select, and once you, I can't do it now because I've already done it. Once you do that, it will add the Steam Library, Steam Library, and as you see here, installed, 22 games, 394 uh, gigabytes, yada, 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 free space. That was the problem I was running into. It didn't show me to go to this drop down right here and go to D. That was the issue. For some reason, it wasn't recognizing my uh, D drive. It was only recognizing my SSD, my C drive, and that was the only issue. And I couldn't figure out for the life of me to do it, how to do it, because none of the guides mentioned that drop down. All the guides just said, "Go to your comments here, add. Go to your comments here, add every single one I found." That's not the fix. You gotta add, add library, drop down, then your D or wherever your files are actually installed if they're not on your C, and then it will work. So I hope that's an easy fix. I hope that helps somebody out there uh, because this was a pain in the ass for me. I was kind of getting frustrated. And uh, yeah, now that I got that fixed, I ain't got to worry about it. And I hope you all have a wonderful day. And uh, like, subscribe to the channel for more content. I don't always do guides on how to help. Usually my content is far off somewhere else. But when I f feel like there needs to be a simpler guide with a simpler explanation for something like this, I try to do them like I did my VR chat one back in the day. So I hope this helps, and y'all have a wonderful day. And all, as always, stay motherfucking drunk, y'all.